Hi everyone, I'm Josh from US Cutter, and today we're going to be talking about using the GNU Image Manipulation Program, otherwise known as GIMP, with the Ghost White Toner System to create full color cyan, yellow, magenta, black, and white toner images for transfer to a dark substrate. The Ghost White Toner System is an entry-level white toner system that can be used with all types of different printers. Today we're going to be using the HP M452DW Color Laser Jet Printer in our demonstration. As you can see right here, you can just swap out the black toner cartridge with the white toner cartridge and you're ready to print the white toner layer. In today's video, the main thing we're going to focus on is the actual software. If you're looking to see something printed and pressed, you would want to go down to the video description below and then check out some of those links uh, down there. You can see that I've already got my image loaded in GIMP. Uh, and the first thing that we're going to need to do is because we're preparing it for a transfer, uh, I'm going to need to flip it around so that it will be legible when I transfer it to whatever object I'm trying to. Uh, so the first thing we're going to need to do is go to Image, Transform, and Flip Horizontally. Now that this is done, we're ready to print our cyan, yellow, magenta, and black layer right now. So all we're going to do is just Control P or File Print. Now we want to make sure that we have the correct printer preferences selected for our type of media that we're using. I'm using the Forever Laser Dark. So tray one is where it's at and I'm gonna select Color Laser Transparency as my media type. Everything else is gonna be left to the defaults and we are good to go. As soon as the image is done printing, let's go ahead and change out that black toner cartridge for the white toner cartridge. Now we need to get our image ready for the white toner printing. So we need to go ahead and make it a black and white image. And to do that, we're going to desaturate it. We'll go in the colors menu, select desaturate. Now you've got a couple of different options here, but uh, average seems to work best for me on this image. So that's what I'm gonna stick to. You may find that some other options work better on your images. So be sure to try those out and not just go ahead and do what I do and stick with average. The next step is to invert the image and that's going to be found in the same colors menu and then just by selecting invert. Now all the white areas have become black and the black areas have become white. Uh, so we're ready to print with that white toner layer. The Ghost White Toner System is an entry level white toner solution that works with all types of different desktop laser printers. Um, because we will be running the laser transfer through the printer twice on this image, there will be some registration errors because it's never going to line it up 100% perfect every time. Uh, so what you can do is adjust the resolution, the X and Y resolution as shown here in the image settings. But uh, personally, I prefer to print uh, from another program because you know if you're doing nested objects or a group of nested objects like this, you're going to want to adjust each one of these individually rather than the entire group like like here. Um, so uh, if you want to see a video of me using the Vinyl Master program to do that, you can find that in the description below. As soon as we're happy with our settings, we can just click print and we are good to go. If you'd like more information regarding the Ghost White Toner system, be sure to check out the links in the description of the video below. And if you have any questions, feel free to shoot an email to sales at uscutter.com or call us at 425-481-3555 and we're happy to answer any questions you might have. Take care. Have a great day.